In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the upgraded camera spider and toilet tower defense. So here we are right now inside the toilet tower defense. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get yourself the upgraded camera spider in this game. But watching all the way up until the end, you guys also didn't um, enough know how to go and get this thing. I'll also be showing it, showcasing it to you guys so far for everybody. Let's go on into it now. But if you are ever in need of Robux and have a computer, go ahead and check out RBX Idle. This program allows you to earn Robux, gift cards, and more with simply a computer. This program has over 100,000 downloads and has already given out millions of Robux to a lot of players. All you have to do is go to the website and click on the download button or you can follow how i'm doing it on screen you can earn with any computer and there is tons of ways to get prizes such as robux gift cards steam discord nitro you can level up for rewards or win prizes in gold rush giveaways once you have the program ready and downloaded you guys can click on start earning and this will make your computer do the work completely for you to get started head to rbxidle.com or click on the link down below in the description and in the comment so guys how do you get this what you guys need to do over here go the shop and as you can see this is actually a an exclusive unit over here guys today it costs 399 robux i'm going to quickly buy one right now if you guys want one of these upgraded camera spiders then all you guys need to do to enter into the giveaway is like the video subscribe to the channel comment down below your roblox username and if you win i'll go and give one of those away to you guys however let's quickly jump on into endless right now and we'll test this thing out so this can go up to 27,000 dps which is pretty good to be fair guys not too bad at all to be honest of course it moves around which makes it a bit better too let's quickly jump on in endless mode guys i'm going to showcase this thing to you because it does look quite cool to be honest right okay so how many guys right never mind we've spawned incorrectly now i need to finally oh uh, yeah i need to put that down in that place but i want to quickly drop down one of these over here guys we'll skip past that right now because of course we need to place a few of these santa tv men down to actually get this thing fully upgraded so i guess guys we'll just wait and save up for those Right, here we go, guys. We should be able to get one of these down pretty soon, at least. Hopefully, at least. Um, right, okay. Are we going to get 200 cash now? There we go. Okay, so we can get our first Santa TV man down. And now to wave 3, let's place another one of those. And then we're going to be able to place another one down when we get over to wave number 4. And then, guys, soon enough, we'll be able to place down one of these exclusive camera spiders now to be honest guys with this it can nearly cover like the whole map or something it's kind of crazy to be honest so we will wait for the next wave you know guys i might actually upgrade that thing as well i don't know you know what no we'll place down the camera spider over here when we get enough which should be after this wave which hopefully yeah as you guys can see we just got enough over there and i will upgrade this thing too so pretty much guys starting off it's only 750 damage then there's 20 range one cooldown zero explosion radius 35 walk range and 14 walk speed when we upgrade it guys it gets a bit more damage a bit more range half 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 its cooldown and it increases the walk range a little bit too which is kind of cool guys so let's quickly upgrade a few more of these santa tv men so we can get ourselves a bit more income so we can of course upgrade this now it costs 700 to upgrade to the next um to like the next level so let's quickly upgrade this right now i don't know how many upgrades there are at in total but yeah, guys, as you can see this is the unit over here which is looking really really cool now we have enough to upgrade that there guys as you can see so it's looking pretty good right now then when we upgrade it again it'll get another thousand damage a five extra range minus 1.7 seconds um sorry minus 0.17 seconds cooldown and plus two walk range which is kind of cool guys so yeah definitely quite exciting let's upgrade a few of these to be fair i probably should have upgraded the 500 ones instead that would have probably give us more for our money but who cares guys we are gonna get that much anyway so we'll be able to upgrade this pretty soon and it's 1.5k to upgrade that again which is quite cool so as you guys can see it kind of has like a projectile like gun thing which is kind of sick and um, that's shooting out to, to the different toilets over here guys let me know though if you guys have got this unit over here in toilet tower defense tell you one thing though the green laser camera man might just be the best exclusive unit there is in the game guys it's such a good unit to be fair but as you guys can see this is absolutely destroyed that over here let's go and get the 1.5k upgrade right now and then after we upgrade it next we'll get another 500 damage plus five range a little bit less cooldown and plus five walk range which is really really good so far guys it can already like cover so much of the map um walk walk wise so that's quite cool Let's just go ahead and upgrade the rest of these though, guys, because of course we want to get as much income as we possibly can so we can get this thing maxed out as soon as possible, guys. Now, I don't know if this will actually have a permanent spot on my team. Maybe if it's like that good, I might keep it. But not going to lie, guys, I feel like I've got better units for this because 
I don't really need something that can travel the whole map, guys. Especially when I've got things like this, which get a bunch of DPS, guys, and a ton of range as well. So I don't know. I mean, it seems good. But is it, like, the top, top level? I'm not sure, guys. Would I say it's worth the 399 Robux? I mean, it kind of just depends on your squad. If you guys really like these movable units, then maybe it would be worth it, guys. But if not, then I'd probably buy something else, guys. Definitely, though, I'd probably buy the Green Laser Cameraman before getting any of this stuff. Because, honestly, guys, this thing's so overpowered. Um, but, yeah, guys, so it's 3k to upgrade that again. I think what I'll probably do here, guys, I might just upgrade one of these and then we should get enough the next wave over here. But as you guys can see, so a few things are starting to get passed over here, guys. I've got some, well, not completely passed, but get through a little bit. Now, the good thing about this, guys, is that I don't really need to worry at all about things getting a bit further through here because it has just so much range, which is the good thing about this. Let's upgrade it again, guys. So now, it, um, on the next upgrade, it'll give an extra 4,250 4, damage plus 15 range um plus 15 explosion explosion radius so it's going to start to explode things an extra five walk range and plus one walk speed which is kind of cool guys but to be fair for that we're probably gonna have to upgrade a few of these first because to be fair that's quite an expensive upgrade guys 14,000. so yeah we definitely need to get our income up before we do that but honestly guys so far this is actually destroying things over here guys it's performing pretty good to be honest and this next upgrade is going to be absolutely crazy so i can't wait until we can get that Anyway, guys, um, let's just upgrade a few of these now. It's 3,000 to upgrade them again. So, we're going to have to wait a little bit over here just because of how expensive this is to upgrade. Now, I have a feeling this might be the second last upgrade, guys, or maybe the last one. We'll have to wait and see, I guess. It did say it went up to, like, 27k DPS. So, I guess it might make sense once it does. Yeah, I think this next upgrade might actually be the final one, to be honest. I'm going to upgrade this and then I'll upgrade another one, guys, just so we can get that extra 500 income every single wave which will definitely be a big help in hand um there we go guys we got that so yeah it shouldn't be too many more waves until we'll be able to max this thing out it's an early wave number 20 as well guys so we've got another boss to test this thing as well um let's upgrade that for 3000 there we go okay so pretty much we got the mutant toilets coming in right now guys this thing's still doing a decent amount to um all the enemies over here so far guys we've got mutant toilet 2.0 though that is coming in soon which could prove a bit of a challenge but honestly guys it is no challenge for this upgraded camera spider this thing is kind of destroying its health right now so yeah it's doing really really well now the problem is things are starting to get through a little bit over here guys would i be in a better position if i just done my normal strategy i'd say yes guys i don't really think um this well if i might just because i'm trying to max this thing out like by itself maybe that's why i'm not doing as good as i normally would guys if i was just to use my normal strategy i don't know maybe that's the case but all i know is that we're about 3,000 cash away before we can upgrade this thing again guys which is going to be quite exciting and to be fair we're going to need it because a lot of things are starting to get through over here i mean of course we are auto skipping on endless right now which is not bad but as you guys can see we've now got this maxed out so it's now maxed out guys and wow okay so all that thing, all them toilets that were just about to come around there were absolutely obliterated by this, guys. This is actually looking to be pretty good, especially the explosion stuff, guys. It just destroys the health of all these toilets over here, guys. This thing might actually be a pretty good um, unit to go in and place down, potentially, guys. It might be a good, good candidate over here. I mean, if I mix it in with my actual, like, normal strategy maybe this thing belongs in my squad guys i'm not sure let me know what are your opinions about this unit i think it's a really really good unit to be fair guys when it's fully maxed out it just obliterates everything to be honest so yeah i'm, I'm quite happy with how that's turned out guys max level i'd say all the levels beforehand though it wasn't really the best but maxed out guys this thing's kind of crazy i reckon if i placed down like another one over here or something it would get kind of mad because that'll be able to cover so much radius on the map like literally guys we could have like two or three of these placed down and they'll be able to cover the whole map um overall which is really really good to be fair guys so yeah maybe these are gonna um have a full place in my squad let me know your opinions on this unit guys but i think that's gonna be it for the video here so like and subscribe for more